Okay, so my when I took my hair out in the house, it wasn't dry, so it was just a big poof fest. So I bought my clip because I knew I just knew it was gonna be um crazy. But um I'm gonna try to twist it back up again so I can live my twist out dreams, but for now it's not gonna work because uh, it wasn't dry, so it's just big big poof. But anyway, I'm going into the grocery store, but I was just thinking to myself, like, I'm a little nervous to go out in public with my gut out, you know what I mean? The thing is, I have confidence in my body. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm happy that I've lost weight and that my stomach is, um, I don't want to say it's flat, but it's not like, I'm not like skinty, like 125, 128 like I used to be. But anyway, regardless, this is going to be my first time going out in public with like a low rise situation, like my whole stomach out. And what I'm saying is I feel a little bit weird because, you know, I got all these stretch marks. Like, I got, I have a lot, okay? So, it's just like, do I please myself and just go? Or do I please other people's eyeballs and pull my pants up or wear a bigger shirt? But you know what? This is what I want to do, so I'm going to do it. Um, I'm going out like this, Okay. I was watching somebody else's vlogs because I've been really into people's vlogs right now. And she had watermelon. I was just like, mm. I haven't had watermelon in a couple weeks. So that's why I'm here at the grocery store. So let's go in. smaller one i'm gonna just go for it because it's the best looking one it was fine i'm back in the car now it was fine girl what did nobody think about me i think i just have like you see me here i think i just have a little ptsd because one time when i was in miami this is before i had kids right this is before i had kids i went to miami right this is before yeah yeah just way before i kids. anyway i was in college i went to miami for spring break and this is before i lost all my weight so i was like I don't know, maybe like, I'm 5'4", I was probably like 150, like 150, and I didn't have the stretch marks like on my stomach at that point, but I had them all on my sides, and um, I was walking around in my bikini, I was walking around, and then you know how girls, we'd be like, oh, when we gotta walk into kind of like a crowd of guys, so anyway, we had to do it, so we walked through these guys, and the guy was like, okay, I see you. I see you walking around in all them stretch marks. I see you, girl. And I was like, that was the most embarrassing thing. Like, why do guys, why are people this way? Like, he gave me PTSD, like, for the rest of my life. Like, I think about that. Like, I think about that. It's like, why would you say that to somebody? What's your point? Like, I'm supposed to be like, thank you. Like, <laughs> thanks. Like, no. What am I supposed to say to that, you know? So anyway, I guess, I don't know, maybe in the back of my mind, I think, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know. But anyway, what nobody think about me in this grocery store and I feel good. So now I'm on the way home. All I got was cereal and some watermelon. Drew gonna be like, what the heck took you so long? Good morning, guys. So I'm back at the, um, what do you call her? Esthetician, right? So I don't even think I said this, but last time I was here, um, she just kind of, check me out and then so our first thing we're gonna do is dermal planning and a mask i'm not gonna lie i feel like i don't even want to do this i just want to get straight to the serious stuff but whatever this was she suggested so we're gonna go ahead and do this so i'm about to walk in there that just mm, mm, mm. Can you see, is that a good angle mm -hmm. okay <laughs> so 
So this is everything that was on my face. Ah, she's a blessing. <laughs> <laughs> and when we get close. Ooh. So this is the hydro jelly. Back it up, boy. If you know what's good for you. Wow. This, this smells spoiled to me. I'm about to do my hair. As you can see, I've already started. I started last night. Only got the perimeter done. These packs are stupid because per pack, I found I can only get five twists done. So that's that. I'm going to finish this pack out, but we're going to have to run back out to the store. But let's finish it. And by the way, the skin, it's feeling so smooth. It's looking good, man. Anyway, because I think Kay snatched my nose ring out last night. I don't know how it came out. So, like, I sleep in my room. Me and Jero sleep together. And then in the middle of the night, well, the morning, like, around 5 a.m., Case will wake up. So, I go in there and spend the rest of the morning with him. Um, so, he doesn't wake anybody else up. And so, sometimes, well, every day, we'll, we go to sleep <laughs> during that time. And when I woke up, I went, went in there and went to sleep. When I woke up, my nose ring was gone. I looked on the bed, couldn't find it. I don't know if I ate it. Or he ate it, it's gone. I have to go and get one because I feel incomplete without it. And I am, before I do that, I'm going to do my best to romanticize my morning. So, lots of B-roll, lots of taking it slow, um, cleaning, tea. We're gonna go ahead and make this aesthetically pleasing, as aesthetically pleasing as possible. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, baby.
go. <laughs> so I actually redid some of my twists. Made them a little smaller. And now we're headed into Weld Mall Kit. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> so I always wanted some of this pompous grass. Huh? Let's see. Let's see the price. What is it running for? Twenty-four dollars just for this. Just for this one. Yeah, they can forget that. I'm I'm not going for that. 